Warning! This video contains frank discussion of matters of sexual morality. Just thought you might want to know. Hey! Welcome back to Clean Cut, where we can talk about the truth about just about anything. As long as we use logic and common sense. This season, we're addressing the parts of the old law which remain valid and grave today. The Ten Commandments. So far, we've talked about the first five commandments, and now it's time to tackle the sixth. Thou shalt not commit adultery. This time, masturbation. What is it? Is it part of the prohibition of the sixth commandment? Given everything we just established last episode about lust, it probably won't take too long to explain masturbation. As usual, we'll be starting with the definition put forth in the Catechism. By masturbation is to be understood the deliberate stimulation of the genital organs in order to derive sexual pleasure. Catechism of the Catholic Church, paragraph 2352, first sentence. Since lust is a violation of the Sixth Commandment, let's go over the definition of lust again and see if masturbation is a lustful act. 1. Lustful decisions always involve desiring a lesser aspect of sex, such as pleasure, more than a greater aspect, such as unity with a spouse. Clearly, masturbation fulfills criteria 1. The person seeks the sexual pleasure for its own sake, but without the greater goods which are proper to a full sexual union. 2. Lustful decisions always involve sex or sex-based motives on at least some level. Most types of masturbation involve sex-based motives, but even if a person masturbates without in any way being motivated by sex or even thinking about it, as long as the action is intended for any reason, sex is still involved. This is because, in the end, this is still an act of stimulating sexual pleasure. Therefore, masturbation fulfills criteria too. 3. A lustful decision can be any action, word, or thought, as long as it conforms to these criteria. It clearly conforms to the first two criteria and is an action, therefore masturbation fulfills criteria three. It therefore follows that masturbation is always a lustful decision and always against the sixth commandment. Next time, what's contraception? And does it fall under the sixth commandment? That's all for now, so keep asking questions, and thanks for watching.